Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Please do consider subscribing if you have not already. I do have some more Bitcoin type videos to show to you guys in the future. I have a few things I'm working on in the pipeline. But for right now, as the title says, these are the top four Bitcoin ETFs that I think you should buy right now or that you know you could buy right now of course none of this is financial advice but you know these are ones that I'm looking into myself so let's just leave it at that uh, we're gonna start out with the uh, first one and all four of these are very very reputable they're not like some you know random coins these are actually like real companies that you know have billions and billions in Bitcoin that they've bought so with this one we're gonna start off with the Bito, B-I-T-O, it's a ProShares Bitcoin Strategy ETF, and all of this information is as of uh, July 17th, 2024. So it looks like the uh, it looks like the net asset value of this uh, specific fund, this specific ETF, is about 1.78 billion as of today, and the expense ratio, it's a net of it, is 0.95, so it's almost 1%. Um, it also says that it looks like it's yielded um, year to date about 43%. So, you know, it's not too, too bad. Um, and it was started in 2021, so it has been around for three, uh, almost three years. So that's not like it was just, it just came up yesterday. Um, so that's, again, a good thing. Um, ProShares is a very good fund advisor. They're a really good company. They have a ton of uh, mutual funds and ETFs. So this is something that's really good to look into. Plus, the, I like the lower dollar cost in order to buy in. It's $22.85. Um, next, we're going to go with the Classic. I have owned this one personally a few different times in my life, but this is the Grayscale Bitcoin Trust ETF. It's called GBTC, uh, Grayscale Bitcoin Trust. So this has you know, $16.53 in assets under management with this, meaning that they own $16.53 billion of Bitcoin. The expense ratio on this is stupidly high. It's 1.50%, but they've also made 62% year-to-date. So this is one where you know that the Grayscale family, they mostly, I think for the most part, and someone can correct me if I'm wrong, they have only really dabbled in uh, Bitcoin. So I don't think that they really sell any other products other than Bitcoin. Um, but either way, this is something that has been around for 10 years. This is almost 11 years that this has been around. Like I said, I've owned it in one way or another over time. I've sold it, owned it, sold, sold it. Like I've done different things with it. So this is just a classic one to kind of look after. Um, it's just like the biggest of the bunch, I think. Now we're going to go to FBTC, the Fidelity Wide Forge Bitcoin ETF. So this one has about 10.12 billion in assets. This one there is no uh, year to date return because it actually did start in 2024, at the beginning of 2024. Um, but this is a big one, and obviously it is Fidelity. So that is a huge lead for us for the name, hugely uh, popular name in all of finance. So you know that what you're getting with this should be a pretty good uh, fund. Um, it's fifty-six dollars, so you know it's kind of one of the more expensive side. Um, but again, it's just like grayscale. It's not a, it hasn't been around as long as grayscale, but it has definitely been around for uh, a while. Um, So the last one I'm going to show you is the IJ's Bitcoin Trust, IBE. 